Workers in the town of Tonawanda celebrating a small victory in their fight against a crematory that's in their backyard. The town board went on record siding with the neighbors. News 4's Nalina Shapiro has more on last night's vote. So what happens next, Nalina? Well, Teresa and Jordan, the town board sent a strong message to Amagon opposing the Sheridan Park crematory. But since the funeral home has been giving the all clear, they could fire it up at any time. We're not against Amagon Funeral Home. You know, they've been in our neighborhood for a long time. They do a good service for the community. We're just opposed to the crematory. Amagon Funeral Home Sheridan Park Crematory has been in operation since before homes were even built around it. But in the past few years, residents have complained about what they say is noise and occasional soot. Last July, the Amagon family voluntarily suspended operations under pressure from the state attorney general's office. The business is in full compliance with the state and has been free to resume operations since January, but hasn't. And last night, the town of Tonawanda Council voted four to one to oppose the crematory reopening unless residents' concerns are addressed. There's a lot of really happy people in there. I know that this is something that the residents I've been working with have, have really you know, worked for for a very long time, and we're happy to have the town support. And the funeral home released a statement saying, in part, as we said last week, we are reviewing all of our options regarding the operations of our crematory. We will continue every effort to be a good neighbor. So we will, of course, let you know any new developments, and um, we'll let you know on air and, of course, on our website, wivb.com. Reporting live, Nalina.